What do you need, civilian? Dr. Madison Lee, I have people with me in need of shelter. You must allow us access at once. I'm sorry, ma'am. No unauthorized civilians allowed inside the city. You'll have to leave now. Lions! I know you're in there. I know you can hear me. You open this goddamn door right now! Now we need to keep going. and I'm surprised to see you here. What can I do for you? Don't talk down to me, Lion. I had nowhere else to turn. You must help us. Project Purity has been overrun. Yes, I'd heard reports of an incident there. What details can you give us? The Enclave. They've attacked Project Purity. James is dead. There may be more. I don't know. You have to do something. Then it's as we feared. Madison, I'm sorry this happened. I wish we could have done something. Then do something now. They've taken over the purifier. Lions, they cannot be permitted to have control over it. It's not right. No, no, no. Calm down. You know as well as I do that the purifier doesn't work. It's useless to them. Perhaps it's time to walk away. That's not true. James, he found what's been missing. We know how to get it running. Is that so? Does the Enclave know this? No, I don't think... I don't know. I, I just don't know what's happening anymore. All right, Madison, it'll be okay. Now, this is James's son, I presume? I can see the resemblance. Yes, he knows what we need. A vault tech computer, something to locate equipment. Please help him. Very well, we'll sort this all out. Hail. Elder on. I... I need to rest, lie down or something. This is just too much. Rothschild should help you, but don't forget that he's Brotherhood. I've never trusted them. Be careful what you tell them. Deck. Knight. I need to collect my wits and figure out what to do next. Okay, excuse me. What do you need? It... Father, might I have a word? Go away. You're going to be shoot out. start by saying that I am sorry for your loss. I was acquainted with your father many years ago. The world has lost one of its few remaining visionaries. 
I have been a part of the Brotherhood for many years. Enough that I was here when Project Purity first began. I did not work directly with your father. He and his team valued their independence, and I respected that. Think nothing of it. Now, Dr. Lee has explained your predicament. You need to locate some vault tech equipment? Are you quite sure? I suspect that would be a waste of time. Regardless, the Brotherhood is not in possession of such a device. There is, however, a way in which we may be able to ascertain the location of one. Yes, well, I'm afraid that with the emergence of the Enclave, the Brotherhood is rather busy right now. I elected to take time from my responsibilities to assist you. Perhaps I was in error. Nonetheless, we may have what you seek. In the archives upstairs is an old pre-war vault tech terminal. I will send word that you need access to it. Indeed. Farewell. Get my hands on one of those enclave vertebrates.
technology and we look like cavemen next to the Enclave. That is not acceptable. Did you have any success with that old terminal? I take it you were successful then. As it happens, the Brotherhood has some information about Vault 87. Let me show you what we know. This map shows the locations of all known vaults in the local area. Vault 87 has been highlighted for you. There. Entrance to Vault 87 will be particularly difficult for you, I'm afraid. The area is highly irradiated. Lethal levels are all around the entrance. Gaining direct access will be quite impossible. Quite simply, you don't. To attempt such a thing would be certain death for you. You share your father's determination, it seems. And in this case, you are correct. There may well be another way. Vault 87 is located very close to the site of Lamplight Caverns. It is entirely probable that the vault may be entered from within the caves. The Brotherhood simply cannot spare the resources necessary to investigate the area. Perhaps you may be more successful. If you do find anything, please return here so that we may decide how best to proceed. I find it hard to believe your father raised such a child. I feel pity for whatever it is you've gone through that has made you so bitter. Dr. Scribe Jameson. She's our keeper of the scrolls. She will want to know what you have found. She spends most of her time in the archives. You'll find them in A-Ring, near the Great Hall. Not really. No. I'm afraid you're asking the wrong person. If you insist, what do you want to know? Well, that depends on who you ask. Lions will tell you it's because we're protecting the poor, innocent people of the Capital Wasteland. Most others here will tell you the same thing. They'll do anything for that man. I'm here for two reasons. One, Lions needs me. He always has, just as much as I need him. We've been through a lot together, he and I. Two, take a look around you. Access to this kind of technology and the benefits it could provide to the Brotherhood is immeasurable. I am, and have been since we first found him well over 20 years ago. Liberty Prime is the designation we found on file for him. Magnificent, don't you think? At least he will be once all systems are operational. It's the energy consumption. Something that big with such advanced weapon systems, uh, we just don't have the means to power it. Not yet. Could I? Yes. Will I? No. Go see Peabody or Bowditch. He was developed as a super weapon back in the days before the war. The first joint operation between Robco and General Atomics International. Apparently, he was meant to help liberate Alaska from the Chinese, but was never completed. They were forced to go in without him. 
They won, but suffered heavy losses. If we can get him up and running well, I think you get the idea. Initiate, you've got a lot of nerve to interrupt. Oh, my apologies, stranger. I thought you were one of these worthless initiates. I swear, these kids would be lost without me here to powder their asses. Talk to Scribe Jameson. She's our keeper of the scrolls. She'll want to know what you found. She spends most of her time in the archives. You'll find them in A-Ring, near the Great Hall. Why do you think I ride these initiates so hard? I make training hell, so fighting those uglies won't be. Killing unarmed civilians makes me sick. Come over here. Try fighting someone who shoots back, fucking cowards. The Brotherhood is at your service. Need something, friend? You honor us with your presence here. Oh, good. She spends most of her time in the Ark. State your business and be quick about it. That's an affirmative. You're clear to enter. just managed to get yourself into all sorts of trouble, don't you? Welcome to the Citadel. Not many civilians get to see the place. Talk to... She spends most of her time in the archives. I've read the reports, seen the initial scans, but I can hardly believe it. I figured those radio transmissions were just old recordings. Never figured the Enclave would actually show up in the flesh. But don't worry. Whatever they try, we'll be ready for it. I'll lead the Pride to knock them out tomorrow, if 
my father permits it. It's the best of the Brotherhood, bar none. No one gets in without my say-so. You've seen them, so you know what we know. What more is there to say? If we can figure out where they're coming from, we might be able to stop them. If not... What aid can I offer you? Hey, name's Greg. Greg Bear. Most of the guys just call me Cody in it. Heard about that mess over at the Purifier. Don't you worry. You're safe here. Gallows? He's not a bad guy, truth be told. He just doesn't talk much. And if it ain't soldiering, that boy has no time for it. Tell you what, though. He's the meanest son of a bitch around here. All business. The rest of us, we get our R&R &R in. Not Gallows. There's even a betting pool on who can find out his real name. Talk to Glade about it. He'll tell you. Now that's... It's about 500 clicks to the northwest. Place is a nightmare. Three irradiated rivers coming together. People there were... not well. But the Brotherhood of Steel came down on the place with a righteous hammer. They called it the Scourge. It was a Brotherhood operation. They marched in and swept the place clean. Most of the people there were half-mutated, cancerous, vile things. And these people... great gang torture squads. It was pure chaos there. The Scourge is the best thing that could have happened to it. This was way back, before the Citadel was fortified. Part of the early recon after the Brotherhood first arrived in this area. One night, a squad of brothers led by Paladin Lions swept into the city from over Mount Bosch, tearing apart anyone who stood against them. They were completely outnumbered, and still they raised that place to the ground. As they swept through, the Brotherhood policed up every non muty child they could find. Turns out there weren't that many. Me and maybe 20 others. The younger we were, the less of a chance that we were mutated. It was ugly work, no doubt, but it had to be done. I'll never forget the sight of the Brotherhood of Steel breaching the breast of the mountain at dawn. Hell if I know. I never knew them. I lived on the street and fought with rats for food. Elder Lyons brought us all back to the Citadel. He said it was the safest place he knew of. This place was still being converted. 
He put us in as initiates and kept a watchful eye over us. He was tough, but he taught us to stay alive. The man's like a father to me. Nah. The amazing thing is Elder Lyons. He risked everything. Went in outmanned and outgunned. I'll never be able to thank him enough. So I do my best to serve the Brotherhood. I know that's what he really wants. In time, I'm sure you'll understand. Welcome. What aid can I offer you, outsider? Need something? What aid can I offer you, outsider? What's been going on? Well, let's see. For years, we've been draining our resources defending the ungrateful residents of this no-man's land. Most of my best friends have either been ripped apart by super mutants or left to join the outcasts. And now an enemy we faced more than 30 years ago has resurfaced, and their tech is still better than ours. What's been going on with you? I really don't want to go into it. Go bug scribe Bowditch. He could talk a dog off a meat truck. Hey, name's Greg. He was a br Hey, you wanted to hear it. Hey, be more careful. The Brotherhood is at your service. Hail to you, stranger. My I'm the best shot in the Brotherhood of Steel, bar none. Not even Colvin can match my kill count. 
That's my story. Hey, wasteland humor. I like that. Got any more, funny man? You just managed to get yourself Brotherhood is at your... The Enclave seems to have developed... I'm sorry, but I really don't have time to talk right now. Perhaps... I am Scribe Jameson. Word of your ordeal has spread. I am truly sorry for the loss of your father. But if I can help you in any way, please let me know. You have? Oh my. This brings to light a sad affair for the Brotherhood. But perhaps it is something that you can assist us with. If you have the time, I have an offer for you. Good. As I'm sure you've noticed, the Brotherhood operates all over the DC ruins, often detached from the main base here at the Citadel. We're short on communication equipment, so many of the groups in the field operate as independent cells, without standing orders. Sometimes, I'm afraid that their missions end in their deaths. As Keeper of the Scrolls, it's my charge to write of each Fallen Brother's deeds.
exactly. A brother fallen in the field may have no one to carry word of his death back to me. In calmer times, we could send detachments and messengers to learn their fates. But with our manpower stretched thin, we have no such luxury. Which is why I must now ask you for your help. Each brother wears a holotag like the one you found. Should you find any of the fallen brethren in the field, I ask that you return their tags to me, so that I might record their deeds in the scrolls. As I told you, with the increase in super mutant activity and Elder Lion's edicts regarding our goals, we are critically short on manpower. Any soldier that I would ask to do this task is one less soldier fighting in the field or defending the Citadel. As much as I hate to involve outsiders, it is necessary if I am to properly maintain the scrolls to honor the dead. We have access to a great deal of technology, and because of that, there are a number of things that we can continue to produce. I will be able to offer you caps for the tags you bring me, but from time to time, I will be able to give you something a bit more interesting. Knowledge is the beginning. How can... Ah. You have. Oh my. If you have... Good. Ex Sh Scroll in. They are on our. Well, the or. I came across something interesting. Quite true, don't you think? You... Very well. It's as simple as this. I need... Bring them to me so that I can record the Fallen Brothers in the scrolls, and I will reward you. And that's all that you need to know. Yet... Yeah. Have you? It's sad. Their names shall be written into the scrolls to be remembered forever. As for you, here's your reward. Use it well and in good health.
What aid can I offer you outside? up to about 1,000 caps these days. Now, come on, come on, what's his name? Ha! <laughs> it's not like he'd tell you anyway. What do you need? Really? <laughs> Irving, are you serious? Oh, man, wait until the other guys hear this. Irving! Here's the pool. You earned it. There, mister. Don't take another step, or we'll blow your fucking head off. You're big, and I don't have any big friends. You better just go out the way you came in. It's not safe, even for someone as brave as you. There's monsters back there. I do, but it's through Little Lamplight, and you're not getting into Little Lamplight. Guess you better find some other way, Mungo. I guess you're okay after all, Mungo. You can come in, but you better not piss me off.
self-obsessed super psychos called the antagonizer and the mechanist. Hey, I couldn't make this shit up if I tried. Until next time, this is Three Dog. Ooh, and you're listening to Galaxy News. to see you alive and well. This is an automated distress message from Vault Tech. Vault 101. Message begins. It feels like you left home a long time ago, but... Left. My father's gone mad with power. If you can hear this, please stop looking for your dad and help stop mine. I changed the door password to my name. If you're hearing this, and if you still care enough to help me, you should remember it. Message repeats. This is an automated distress message from Vault Tech. Vault 101. Message begins. It feels like you left home a long time ago, but... I know you're still out there. I just hope you're still alive to hear this. Things got worse after you left. My father's got mad with power. If you can hear this, please stop looking for your dad and help stop mine. I changed the door password to my name. If you hear this, and if you still care enough to help me, 